So ganun ako kagago dati bro. Seryoso? Grabe naman talaga Father Joe no? Who would have thought na, you know, isang dating ganun magiging Father Joe ngayon. Um, how did you kill that demon in you? Well, I really did not kill him. Instead, he became a priest. Huh? Um, di ko magets, Father. Um, how did the demon become a priest? Sige, explain ko sa'yo. For example, I am a very powerful wizard. Tapos, I will give you uh, the strongest weapon in the entire universe. And that weapon is this. This is a stick that is made from the tree of good and evil, no? But here's the catch. You need to maintain peace in the entire universe. However, the stick has a positive and a negative side. It has a good side and a bad side, no? The north tip, you can manifest anything that is good. But if you use the south tip, you will manifest everything that is bad and evil. What will you do if I give this to you? So, syempre, I just need to remove this. So, I need to remove the south tip. Oh, diba? Wala na. Okay, you have removed the south tip. Pero tingnan mo ulit yung stick. Diba meron pa rin siyang north and south? Ibig sabihin, you will still be able to manifest negative stuff coming from the south tip. So, anong gagawin mo? O huh? nga, no? So, I will remove again. O. Oh. O. Oh. Parang ayaw talaga, Father Joe. Alright, see? Kahit umabot ka pa sa molecular level, meron pa din yung north at south. Ibig sabihin, you will still be able to manifest good or bad things with that tiny stick that you're holding. Ngayon naman, kung titingnan mo lahat ng stick na pinutol mo, yung maliliit. It has north and south tips din. Ibig sabihin, yung mga bagay na akala natin ay masama, meron din pala yung magandang na idudulot. Tama ba? There is no absolute good or evil in this universe. Pero di ba, Father, kailangan talaga na umiwas tayo sa masama? We need to follow God and we need to remove ourselves from the influence of Satan. Tama? Ito kasi ang problema when it comes to mainstream religion is because we try to, you know, polarize things like this is good, this is evil. There's an absolute good, there's an absolute evil. Meron tayong God, merong Satan, merong blessings, merong curses. However, this dualistic thinking, this is actually just generated by our minds. We actually need this in order for us to function properly in this world. Hindi ito masama. However, everything is actually just one and the same. If you look at a battery, a battery will not function kung wala siyang positive at wala siyang negative. Di ba? Yung coin, meron siyang face at meron din naman siyang tails. Meron siyang heads, meron tails. What we need to understand or what we need to know is actually not elimination of certain parts of ourselves but rather we need to learn self-mastery. Self-mastery is actually walking in the middle path. Kung titingnan mo yung symbol ng Zen Buddhism, merong dalawang isda. May black fish na may white dot sa gitna at may white fish na may black dot sa gitna. Ibig sabihin na these forces, these opposing forces are in balance. Kaya lang, if you try to do something good, meron pa rin yung negative effect. Kahit konti. At kung may ginawa ka namang something bad, meron pa din yung positive effect. Kahit konti. For example, let's say, etong war. You try to defend your country. That's good. However, in the process of defending your country, you are killing people. Is that good or bad? What I'm trying to say right now is that we need to master ourselves and we need to learn how to walk in the middle path because everything is just one and the same. We need to have a better understanding of ourselves. Saan ba nangagaling ang mga urges natin? Bakit natin nagawa ang mga bagay na ito? If we learn how to walk in the middle path, 
we will learn how to use this stick. That stick is a representation of yourself. You need to master yourself in order to be able to maintain peace in the whole universe. I hope that makes sense. Namaste.